Joshua, did you fit the Battle of Jericho? 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 Joshua, did you fit the Battle of Jericho? Are the walls a tumbling down? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and biocomponents. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. Cyberlife Warehouse and Docks, West Torrance Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. They'll never accept what we are. What was your function before coming here? Doing this. What do you care? Have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Oh, that's the that's the stripper. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. I think. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. From the Eden Club. I just never thought to do that, or... I know there was something else here. Nope, guess not. Simon, tell us what to do! Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Maybe it's worth a try. Yay, everybody likes me. Okay. I'm in. One hundred percent. That's a first. <laughs> hmm. 
Most people did that. Shouldn't brag too much. Okay, back to these two. You're gonna be okay? We'll get some help here. Where's here? Is this where that sanitation worker told me to go? I don't know. Got a bad feeling about this place. But at least we'll be out of the rain. Good evening. Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Come in. Come on in. Don't be shy. <laughs> always watching, always judging. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of big friend. Whoa, you are a big Luther boy. just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big empty old house. Please, make yourselves at home. This is a rather large house. How did you come to be here? How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Devian, huh? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. I thought they were banned there. Yes, that's, that's exactly what we want. Of course. Well, I can help you, but first we have to get rid of your tracker. I already tracker? did. Yeah, all androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on, follow me. Yeah, we can't uh, trust him. One can wait for us in the living room. We don't, no, don't trust him so easily. 
course. Uh, something smells rotten in Denmark. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. I'll just take a quick look around, if you don't mind. Zlatko? I have no idea how to pronounce your name. Boy, Staff would be super jealous of this. Doesn't ask for anything, trusts us right off the bat. Definitely, definitely cannot trust him as much as they seem to be. To her credit, she looks a little skeptical. I thought I broke my programming. Nice detail. I don't like this place. I don't either. Damn that man. Let's go. I have a bad feeling. Alice, we have nowhere else to go. We have to trust him. You're not going to let us go back, are you? Nope, you're not. <laughs> That's what I thought. Now, this really reminds me of Resident Evil 7. Yeah, this won't end well. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be alright. Yeah, I'm sure she's fine. Come on, Alice. This way, please. What did she see? If you could just stand over there. Have I mentioned I don't trust you? Well, here we go. why it's so hard to find them so actually there's no reason to remove your tracker what you said that yeah people believe what they want 
you deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them, sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No, I, I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Oh, no. Wow. How could I be so a misled? Wants to be a mother. That's that's so sweet. I'm so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Oh God. get for having a dream it always ends up the same way tears and disillusion believe me you're better off being erased and feeling nothing no more pain no more hopes dashed I almost envy you Carl! is there anything I can do <laughs> Oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, <laughs> what happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. You bit me. I'm going to teach you some manners, you little bitch. Carl, wake up, Carl! Indy, I love you. Meet me in the living room. Okay. I guess that's one option. Oh. Ball. I'm scared. Our situation has not improved. Okay, I'm really running out of time. How do I do that? I'm just start pulling stuff. What? Did I just fuck up? I think I just fucked up. I don't think that was supposed to happen that way. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Help us. Hi. Her memory. No, this can't be happening. You have to remember for her sake. She likes to play with us, creating monsters for his amusement. But who 
who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. You must remember who you are. Otherwise the little one will die. 